This is your first cold, buddy. First cold! How do you feel about that? You building some antibodies? I don't know if you guys are ready for this. I mean, we're a whole lot of, a whole whole lot of everything. Good but morning. I figure. What do you figure? I figure it's just where we're at in life. Yeah. I thought we could talk about our five month old baby. Yeah. Meaning, like, just our life right now mm. in this season. Well, first of all, we have a little cold at the moment. And so. I, this is this is your first cold, buddy. First cold! How do you feel about that? You building some antibodies? Yeah. I I think I think I didn't realize how sad that would make me. The cold. Yeah. Yeah. What do you see? What do you see? Hi. <gasps> Peter's making some French toast because yesterday I made some French toast and he enjoyed it so much. It's so good. Although yesterday Mary made it with sourdough and it was delicious, but we don't have any more sourdough. So I'm just using plain old bread. Okay, so five months old. I think the biggest, what would you say is the biggest like developmental spot that he's in? I think the relational smiling. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. It was like all day long. You get like reactional, relational smiles, and that is super fun. Except when he's tired. <laughs> yeah. But let's talk more like also just like our life. Yeah. And like things we want to remember. Let's see. Is that my microphone? Mm -hmm. Oh, Peter was laughing so hard in the car the other day. <laughs> what were we talking about? We were, I think we were singing. Were we singing? Oh, we were singing and Mary kept like giving me the mic, like holding up her hand like it was a microphone to me and then going to her and then it was, I was just laughing. I was like. You are so funny. He said you are your 11 year old self. Yes. In grown up person body. And it's true. It's true. When? Yeah. What about life? I don't know. I don't know. Just life. Like, I just feel like this moment is like a time capsule. Yes. Because we were both up a lot through the night for different reasons. And so we kind of. I feel like our inhibitions are gone or whatever, like, we're at a very raw state. You, you feel like this will be an unfiltered <laughs> video clip. Yes, an authentic video. Um, I got nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's, it's one of those things where it's like, it's either authentic and perfectly raw, or like, your brain just isn't working, so like, mine's will turn the camera off. I think we might be at the ladder at the yeah. moment. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We're here, gonna get a taste here, test. Here, here's a here's a question. What do you put on French toast? I feel like there's such variance. I'm gonna go wild and crazy today. Uh oh. Do something that Mary would never do. Well, that's okay. Well, first. Oh, brilliant! First, uh, I'm doing the powdered sugar today, but I grew up doing cinnamon sugar. Okay. So um, granulated white sugar with cinnamon. Yes but I just sprinkle powdered sugar and I'm gonna put strawberries like sliced thin on, on top. I'm like a plain Jane, mostly textural plain Jane. So that's why he said I would never put strawberries on it because it's like a different texture and that's probably true. But I, I remember going to a friend's house when I was, I don't know how old I was, but I was thoroughly confused by the thought of syrup on French toast. I had never done that. Yeah, and, I hadn't either. And my friends did, and I think in college, they, they have this like picture of college cafeteria French toast with syrup on it. Uh, I'm like, where's the powdered sugar? So you did powdered sugar, girl? Butter and then powdered sugar. Okay. 
Yep. Anyways, so here's my French toast. Cut up some strawberries. Cheers. Oh yeah, that's the stuff right there. Mm. Oh yeah. I gotta get the money shot. <laughs> yes. Okay, the way I'm going to make myself feel productive, right? First thing in the morning, I'm gonna clean up this little room. It won't take long and it'll make a big impact in my eyes. <laughs> and it'll make me feel like, yes! I'm carrying you with me. I just got done up on the third floor. I went through his, uh, Elijah's next bin of clothes for like the next size up. And it's so funny because now, you know, a lot of friends and family and strangers gave us hand-me-downs. And I basically just sorted through the sizes and put them in buckets and thought, I don't know who this little person is going to be. So I don't know if he's gonna be like a, bold stripes kind of guy or <laughs> or rather if I want him to wear bold stripes or if I want him to wear muted colors or or whatever and now I know who he is and so now I went back through the next size of clothes and I was like yes this one is definitely his personality nope this one is definitely not his personality so I have some more to donate I or I have a couple of friends who have babies as well that we can pass it on to it's the perfect uh, scenario to have friends with babies right behind yours like a month younger or something so you can pass the clothes along and then I decided not to go through the bin of like 12 month clothes because by 12 months or you know around that age they're starting to have opinions and personalities and they like certain things or they love the this color or that color, and so you wanna keep all of those clothes that are those colors. So I was like, I don't know who he's gonna be in six months from now, so I'm not gonna go through those clothes and weed out the ones that I do or don't think he'll wear because he might have opinions by then, maybe not quite by 12 months, maybe more like 18 months. You know, he's starting to say the word car or bear or whatever. And if there's a bear on the outfit, maybe he'll love that. And so I need to take up this diaper, put it in the laundry, take this laundry, put it in the laundry. And I thought maybe he'd be waking up by now. He still usually does like 35 minute naps, but once a day he does a two hour nap. And then I phantom hear him talking sometimes or like crying. I'll be like, that's him, right? <laughs> then it's not. So I'm gonna go rush around and do these last couple things. Afternoon activity is <laughs> tummy time and water in a dish. What do you see, bud? switched the water to his toes and he's looking at a book. Um, quick question, how are you so cute? How is it possible? How? How are you so cute? I was just gonna make some banana bread because, you know, we don't have yogurt or sour cream, which this recipe calls for. I've loved this recipe. So, guess I'm not making that. Also, Elijah needs me. Good thing we didn't have the yogurt. Well, Elijah just went to sleep. Well, it's probably been a half hour or so. And Mary and I have been sitting out here on the deck. And you want to tell them what just happened? I just saw, well, we both just saw our first lightning bug of the sea. I actually saw one yesterday. I'm sorry. You did? Yeah. 
He hadn't made that confession yet. <laughs> I, was I, was, uh, I was living the moment with her. Yes. Um, yeah, it was just flying right by here. and that Lightning bugs are magical. I, I think I just realized, I think I've let my childhood um, fascination with lightning bugs, like fate, go by the wayside. But as I think about it, like these little bugs make a light. That's crazy. It's crazy. That is crazy. <laughs> what I feel, other? I feel really bad about like smearing them on the driveway as a kid. <sighs> I mean, boys will be boys, I guess. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm saying I feel bad. Okay. <laughs> I also feel bad. <laughs> I guess it's not only for boys. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh man. Look. Yeah. As I as we said this morning, <laughs> I didn't sleep well last night, and well, neither of us did because Elijah was up for the first part of the night, and Mary was helping with that while I was sleeping, and then I had trouble going back to sleep at one point. Anyways. I got a little nap this afternoon. Thank you, honey. Babe, I'm pretty sure it was three hours. Three hour nap. Two I, three hours. I don't do that. Never, and ever. My voice sort of like... Died. Died today as well. I actually feel pretty good cold-wise, but I think my body needed that rest. And But anyways... Um... Yeah, I was going good. to say, what other fun animal facts besides lightning bugs did we learn today? Well, we learned that, I don't know, we were reading, <laughs> we were reading an animal facts kids book before bed with Elijah. <laughs> it has big bright pictures and we learned that... A group of jellyfish is called a... smack. A smack. Yeah, that's right. And we learned... I, okay. Oh, the, crying. Oh. Okay. okay. As always. <laughs> we'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for joining us. Oh, yeah. Good night. Good night, Alex.